Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm your match commentator Derek Ray at the microphone and sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player Stuart Robson. And tonight we've got the semi-final of the Champions League coming up for you. Stuart, your expectations? Well, Derek, they don't come much bigger than this, do they? This will be a top quality game between two of the best sides in Europe. Let's hope it lives up to its billing. Here's the starting 11 for Porto. Well, it's great to see them playing with the front two, but for it to work, they need to have a good understanding. They need to link up with each other and provide a different set of skills. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Pepe Reina is the goalkeeper. Luis Alberto plays with Sergei Milinkovic Savic in the centre of midfield. And the centrepiece of the attack today, Chiro Immobile. And underway now in this Champions League semi final first leg. Sergio Oliveira and an astute piece of defending well, that is how to play advantage Chiro Immobile illegal play and hence a free kick Immobile excellent defending well, you never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match winner, but this man might be a decent shout. What are you expecting to see from him, Stuart? Well, he's their top marksman, but he's also a great all-round player. He just has that... Oh, look at this, Stuart, an opportunity! Well, placement over power, but it didn't work out for him. Uribe. This is looking threatening. And let's give credit to the defending. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Now far from a smooth challenge. Now will the referee produce a card? And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, and it certainly deserved a yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. He's played it short here. Felipe Anderson. Well, high and more than a bit hopeful.
and keeping it on the ground slightly off target however Mateo Suribe Ottavio now Attack full of promise. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Oh, but they've lost it now. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. They need to get back. And there it is! The first goal of the semi-final! A huge moment! Extraordinary scenes! play and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back and his movement's so clever once he gets onto it there's only one for his head smash it as hard as possible what a good goal with Ottavio determined defending Pedro moving it forward Chiro Immobile possession changing hands Well, they certainly should be level. That was a great opportunity to score. Francesco Acerbi Pedro and it's a really poor challenge now what's the referee going to do about it and following the infringement a caution yeah no surprise there that was always going to be a booking Class defending. Really getting stuck in defensively. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Do they have the guile to open up the defence? Oh, he really bruised the crossbar. Oh, it's in. A two-goal cushion now. And the lead fully merited. Well, just look at this. He's so bright in the box. He's first to the ball and then a decent finish. It's a good bit of play. promising could play it in and the danger still on well they can bring it out now free kick awarded then by the referee 
Well, play was allowed to carry on, but now that it's come to a halt, a caution. Luis Alberto. Luis Felipe. Danilo Cataldi with it. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. Luis Alberto. Into the advanced position. Pulls it back. Could be. And so it is, the first half story has been written. Well, truth be told, he's only had a very limited influence on this game, Stuart. Yeah, he struggled to get on the ball in dangerous areas. You can argue the service hasn't been good enough, but I don't think his movement has been dynamic as it normally is. He certainly needs to improve here. Second half of this Champions League semi-final leg underway. Marusic and the ball with Milinkovic Savic oh, couldn't quite find his teammate promising pass oh, didn't seem to be too much in that offside decision Luis Felipe, Cataldi. Well, the referee wasn't going to let that go. Well, some referees might have reached for the yellow card, but not this one. Yeah, another foul, and he will get a yellow card, that's for sure. Firing it towards goal, couldn't quite finish. Well, if they can just get one, it will certainly make it interesting. No let up, plenty of pressure. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. Mbemba. Mehdi Karami. And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. So making the substitution now. And into the last 30 minutes now. And that pass could be trouble. And the alarm bells are ringing. That's high-level goalkeeping. Well, that's a fantastic save. He's such a good keeper.
And they're making a change. So the corner played into the box. Not trying his luck with the header, but too much elevation. Ottavio Now can they open up the defence here Dangerous looking attack Happy to take on the shot well, he's gone back to give the free kick, the referee here. He tried to play advantage, but it didn't accrue. Now, they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. This to get themselves back into it. And the penalty is converted. I don't think anyone really questioned him. Well, let's take another look because this is how to take a penalty. He strikes it with such confidence and composure. It's a brilliant penalty. So back underway at 2-1. Tight contest here. Successfully got past him. Oh, and heading it just at all. Mehdi Karami A bit of running room now on the wing But they dealt with the threat first Might be able to set up the chance Immobile Felipe Anderson No, nothing productive, really. Grujic. Well, I have to say, these fans have been excellent. They still believe they're going to get back into this. Just ten minutes remaining here. Tony Martinez. A super tackle, and they've won possession. Tony Martinez. Can they fashion something? They need a goal. Takes aim! Well, not a million miles away from the equaliser. Well, he couldn't quite get it on target, but at least they're making chances now. Milinkovic Savic. Immobile now. Well, it hasn't been a great performance, but the fans have been brilliant. Just listen to the noise. Can the players respond and find this equaliser? 
spot on with that tackle. Lucas Leiva. Pedro. Can he finish them off? Still a chance. But it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Luis Diaz. Here's Grujic. On the attack in the closing phase. And let's give credit to the defending. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. Pedro in the middle of things. Not to be this time. And there goes the final whistle. It's a victory for the visitors in the first leg of this tie. Well, they'll be pleased with that victory, but it's a slender lead they're taking into the second leg. And I think they'll be confident, but it's going to be tight, that's for sure. The one man who certainly caught the eye, Ciro Immobile, interest to a verdict as regards his performance. Well, I thought he was excellent. Not only did he score a good goal, but his general play was outstanding. He certainly played a major part in their win here today.